Welcome back. We're here. We're doing it. It's more Spyro. We've got some low resolution and low energy. Boy, howdy. Welcome. Glad to have you. It's a burb. Damn. Get shrecked, my dude. Oh boy. Another day, another spiral level for you. We are here and we are doing it. It's been, uh. Damn. <laughs> Gonna say, it's been a, it's been a long day for your boy. I um. Put, the mess, I put together my first computer for the like first time ever in, in my life. And now they shut down our ship too. Purely just using tutorials and YouTube and. If you could stoke up the own. fires under the boilers, I'm sure you could make your way to the ship. The steam from the boilers will activate our highly advanced machinery. My own power and will. We're, uh, I'd say we're like 90 to 95 percent of the way there. I still gotta do the whole Windows thing and whatnot, but we've got the majority of the thing built, and. Um, if you could stoke up the fires under the boilers, I'm okay. Stoke up the fires, gotcha. Um, I don't know. If, if you've never built your own PC, highly recommend because, like, I don't know. I had the typical, it didn't boot for the first time. It's like, you know. Almost everybody has that experience. But man, once you like boot into the BIOS for the first time, that's, um, I don't know. That's kind of a satisfying feeling in my opinion. It's like, you know you're not totally there, but you're like most of the way there. It's like all of that hard work and everything just kind of paid off for the most part. Oh, I see. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. But yeah, that, um, that's what I did with my day. I didn't play any video games. I didn't run any errands. I literally just, like, I went and got the last piece that I needed, which was the graphics card. And I, I went and got that in the morning, and then I spent the better part of... It's kind of embarrassing to say, but probably a collective, like, 10 hours trying to build my first computer. And, uh, yeah, it was, it was, uh, it was slow going, but we eventually got there. But, like I said, man, going into that BIOS for the first time, and you see that, like, everything is seated properly, and you didn't... up the RAM or bend any pins or anything like that. Your CPU is not on fire. It's like that's um that makes you feel good. It sure oh, god damn it. It sure does. Unlike that.
unlike my own platforming ability. <laughs> Holy shit, boys, we did it. So... Oh shit, I didn't even see the bucket guy still there. Oopsie. Okay. And for anybody who's like still with us in this video, one, I appreciate you big time. Two, if you're wondering what the specs are, it's a 7950X GPU and a 4070 Ti Super for the GPU. Uh, RAM is, uh, I don't know, I can't remember the brand. T-Force, Tinder, whatever. 6,000 megahertz or whatever. And, um... We're, uh, We're air-cooled this time. My current PC, which is what I'm recording this on right now, um... It's, uh... It's got an AIO in it. And, uh, but yeah, this time we're fully air cooled and so far so good with the CPU town. Let's just hope it stays that way, am I right? Oh shit. Gotcha. from the first game. Where is... Am I missing something? Probably... Oh. Am I missing that? Is there nowhere else to go? This is fucking... Okay, I see. I see. I see. I see. And boom goes the dynamite. That help? Thanks for getting our ship fired up, Spyro. Now we can proceed with our counterattack on Zephyr. Please take this talisman as a token of our gratitude. Hell yeah, we did it, boys. Mission accomplished. Love their little firefighter helmets. Oh, hit that guy. No, oh, not me, hit that guy. Hell yeah. And with that, I'm going to leave this episode right here. I appreciate you guys for watching, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.